G'day guys, my name's Josh, you can call me Jean Wordle, and welcome back to 7 Days, where we are back in Demolishers Only. Despite both my and the Demolishers' best efforts, I managed to survive another Horde Night. I built a base, the base collapsed, and I sprinted around like a scared chicken, but managed to keep all the goo inside me, which means we're back for another week of explosions. I mean, I say another week of explosions, that, I mean, one bad demolisher, one wrong move, and it is all over. I, I have no more lives left. This is now permadeath. But uh, what I did do, I went and did all the looting all in one go and put it all into all these chests because there was an obscene amount of loot bags. I did slow time down to do that so I didn't waste any sort of daylight that I had to actually play the game. Yes, I know it's probably a little bit iffy, but I stand by because it means there's more time to go and actually do some raiding. So all the loot is just in these boxes here. All the way through, there's books, there's about a billion spot helmets. There's some good stuff, especially that. I'm just grabbing all of the books so I can read them straight up. Ooh, there's a supercharger mod in there. I didn't actually look at the things I was looting. I just picked up all the bags and as soon as I was full, just chucked them into boxes. So I haven't actually gone through and seen what I got. Eight rifle books, $6,000 redos. There's a lot of gubs. There's a lot of gubs in here. I think, did I miss you? Don't know why my game keeps kicking to the left, but we're okay. Nah, I think we're fine. All right, are you going to unlock anything for me? I'm most excited about you, though. Make my mini bike even faster. Insulated Lighter Mod is a great mod to have to protect against explosions. The comments have been telling me that. Uh, explosive magazines. Okay, great time charges now. Four vehicle magazines. that can unlock the motorcycle. Not yet. Damn it, I really want that better bike. It's a dream. I've left the rifle book still last. So I've got eight of them. Are you going to unlock... I think at least the tier four sniper, but maybe not. Oh, we're not far away. We're not far away for getting ourselves the tier five sniper rifle that has unlocked the tier four bloody bonza. Right, you can come with me. I'm going to have to make a couple of trips to come back and get all this stuff to get everything back home again. Yeah, now nah, I know, tradie. Got some errands to run first. There's just so much ammo. There's so, so much ammo. And because I'm using rifles, I'm really not burning through it Ooh, fast at all. No, no, the spot helmet's always going to be better. I'll chuck you back into them. Did, ooh, did get some NVGs though. And another 6,000 stack of brass. Thank you very much. Some old night vision cogs. I was saying the other day, actually, that I kind of wanted some of those. So, ooh, and a tier five, same with the sledge too. So pretty stoked to come across one of you. I'll take you. I'll scrap you and scrap you. Uh, I'll take that one. I'll take you as well. Uh, and then I'll start <laughs> just start running things back home again. I'm nowhere close to having the pocket space for this. I just wanted to quickly look while I'm running. The motorcycle handlebars. We've already got a, a chassis. I'm 10 books. I'm 10 books away still? I really thought I'd made some better progress on that, but clearly not. Oh, bonk myself in the chin, but we're okay. I'll open the doors and drop everything off. I don't think I'll spend much of today running all the loot back home. I can do that tonight without too much trouble. I do have the bike after all. But most important stuff can go back with me. You can all go in. I can't read Claudie's treasure map because I haven't done one yet, but I can read Jennifer's. I'll read you. The rest of you can go into boxes. All right. It's a brand new day, a brand new week. Oh. I do need to tell you as well that because I did survive another week and because apparently I have no self-control, um, I have made the game worse for me again. So now, uh, I was unsure how I wanted to do it because I didn't want to make it too impossible. But what I've done is I've made the uh, zombie block damage, the explosive damage, and how much damage to do blocks in general. I've turned that up. So... I was already having some issues with that before, and I've only made it worse. I don't quite have what I need to... Oh, I'm short on springs. It's always bloody springs. Also duct tape, but oh, I can't really do much about that now. No point unless I have the springs with it too. I still left most of my Horde Knight stuff back at the base. I'll have to go and get it. I've got some extra purple dye from those XP gogs. Uh, most of my stuff's already purple. Yeah, all right, AK. Okay. Yeah, all right. You've been with me, through, with me through thick and thin. You can get purple fired as well. I'm going to need to run a couple of stacks of ammo like you. Then I get my regular stuff back out of the boxes and we're ready to rock and roll. Nice. Good. I am going to roll with the NVGs. Uh, that would definitely come in handy when it gets nice and dim, but I've, I've wanted them for a while. Be silly not to bring them with. 
I'm still so sad that it all collapsed. It was working so well. It was working extraordinarily well until very suddenly it wasn't working very well at all. I'm not hungry. I'm not thirsty. I'll shuck you in to kind of keep myself at bay anyway. This stuff can all just hang out until later. Ammo, nail guns, molotovs, the works. I did definitely need my um, perception goggles with me though. Is there anything else in here that I actually need to take with? I don't think so. I've got XP goggles on at the moment. I do. That'll do us. That'll do us. I think I'm sure I'm missing some dollar redos. In you go. That's always a good thing to have with me. Don't want to traipse around and eat nothing but ramen noodles, even though it is delicious. But speaking of, let's go talk to Trady and get the day cracking. I'd super love. Could you be any louder? I don't think so. But what I'd super love, you don't have any springs. You don't have motorcycle parts. So you don't really have a lot for me to buy. I think I came to you. Oh, I did. I came to you else? yesterday. But you're now offering me tier four stuff. Tier four infestation. Time to do some chores. Oh, that's sketchy. That's real sketchy. That's got a lot of underground areas that trap you in. Good deal. I'm gonna give it a go though. I'm gonna give it a go. I should probably run with some extra AP ammo. I do have the two snipers, better make use of it. Yeah, that makes me nervous. Like dropping down into places is a death sentence. I had to get very lucky and very precise in my shooting. So basically impossible if I'm going to stand a chance at that. And I know that church has a lot of bad spots. I'll quickly just come back home because I did have you over one of you. I'll leave the other one, uh, I guess in my weapons, <laughs> my weapons box. I haven't really made a horde box yet. You can get scrapped just for the rifle parts. That's all good. But what I wanted to do before I take on off I, I'm burning through concrete so quickly. I can't rely on just looting cement anymore. So I would like another forge, please. We're going to need three duct tapes and a log. That's fine. I can do that. No, I can't because I have no wood because I left it all out at the horde base because I am a pelican. Shit. I also have any wood frames with me, I've just realized. Right. Okay. That makes things a little bit, a little bit less fun. But I need to make myself a new forge to smelt stone into cement. And I'll also need another cement mix while I'm thinking of it soon. Which you need... You need springs too? God damn. <laughs> There's such a lack of springs and everything needs it. I'll chuck that forge on now. In fact, I'll make it in my pocket so I can get your crafting straight away. I just ran back and got my cobble and my wood from the base. Oh, I want to put it here though. These boxes might have to go. Oh, sorry. Doing a I had such great plans. It's like, this is going to be great. I can go. I can do things. I can go and get these uh, jobs done early. And instead, I've gotten distracted by making my life a little bit more organized. Just got to do it sometimes. It's no one's idea of a good time, but you just got to do it. I said before I didn't have a horde box yet. It was right bloody in front of me when I said that. So, damn it. <laughs> I hate when I have this idea in my head and I think it's right and very clearly it's not, but I'm not looking for that. I'm already trying to think of the next thing. You can go into there. You can go into them. You guys are all good. All right. That is a perfect spot for my new forge. That can get some concrete going and then I can finally go. And actually, that church is a pretty good spot to get, uh, to get some springs. So not a bad shout. I'll take... You, please. I don't have the crafting speed just yet, but I can put you into them. Put some fuel in, get some stones in. So when I come back later, I'll have plenty of concrete to go. Okay, maybe not plenty. I've only got a little bit of stone because I've already used so much of it, but all right then. I don't need two stacks of that ammo, so you can go away. All right, we're good. We're fine. Everything's rocking and rolling. <laughs> let's, let's finally set off. Go and find that church, find those springs, and try and make it through that basement without too much issue. I can see the spire. I can see the church. It's right next to all oh, the tailor, man. I'm not a bad PY that one either. There's a demo waiting for right at the front. I, uh, I'm, I'm not going to lie. I'm actually pretty nervous about this. It's been a few days since I filmed the last Fortnite, so I'm definitely out of practice. Oh, it's not, not where you want to be when you don't trust your shooting. Oh, man. I'm so sorry. You're going to get so exploded that there's not much I can do to help you. Come to think of it, though, I haven't actually spent the... I haven't spent... I haven't spent the skill points that I got from Horde Night last night. I could buy the max level of perception so I don't have to wear the goggles all the time, but they're basically free points right now. I could probably use them somewhere else that's better. In fact, given I'm breaking things down all the time, uh, putting a point into salvage operations seems like a pretty good idea. Get some more stuff out of you. I also need... Oh, Cardigo's already clapped, so... What was the other one? Parkour, maybe? 
But I just spent so many more points in the agility to get parkour. I could do the next level though. What do you actually give me though? Stamina costs uh, 30% less, increased safe falling distance by 4 meters, and never break a leg. Yeah, right. <laughs> I have a bit of a penchant for snapping my legs, so not a bad plan. I'll take you. And then the next point. Oh, I can't quite afford the next point of running gun. That would be nice. You know what else is nice? Springs. All right. Well, no time like the present. Let's go find the marker. Give you a little tickle like your Elmo and reset the joint. Beautiful. All of this is made... Oh, jeez. All of this is made out of wood, though. I can see someone's big hoof is hanging out oh, underneath. <gasps> I didn't put the suppressor back on you. I didn't put the suppressor back on my rifle, which means everyone's going to wake up. The whole point of running the AP uh, lesser rifle was because it was suppressed and I could go stealthy, boys. Shit. All right, well, uh, it's still got AP ammo in it. I might actually, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to go like this to try and guarantee that these guys are going to die nice and quickly. Load AP into my better rifle. Shit. How did you guys wake up with apparently the loudest rack of the slide you've ever bloody heard? God damn it. God damn it. I thought I was being good. I thought I was being good. Clearly, shit. Clearly, though, I wasn't. It's already kicked off. It's already kicked off immediately. Oh. Ow! Yep, I tried to jump him. Didn't work. Wow. All right. <laughs> I'm not even worth your time anymore, apparently. Go back to a regular ammo while I've got a bit of a gap. What are you doing? <laughs> what? Explain yourself. You just, just, just fucked that particular glass pane. You're like, you know what? I don't like it. It's lead line and bad for your health. I'm going to break that shit apart. What was going on there? That was certainly one way to start the day. It wasn't too long ago that I was living here, though. It's like, I think the last series, actually. No, it was no repair that I was living at this place. And I kind of miss it. It was lovely. I had the rooftop garden. The bell still doesn't bong, and it's always disappointing. One day, one day they'll add that in, and I won't be expecting it, and it will make my bleeding day. But can't get distracted by that, and all the memories I have, I have to keep on going. Down into you. There's absolutely going to be some demos in here. And a lot of rather unfortunately combustible bookshelves. Can I make that jump? Oh, I can with my sweet parkour ability. No one's hanging out down the backside though. If someone spawns in, can I even escape? No one's in there. Now we're good. Now we're good. Okay, but just for safety, can I close? No, there's no, there's no hatch on top of the stairs. No luck. There's another rifle book, which will give me two more to go so I can make it to your five. Another forger head book and sh shotguns. All right, yeah, nah, cheers for that one. Harvesting tools. I've already got the schematic for a burning shaft. If I even have a burning shaft schematic back uh, or uh, mod back home, I've already found chlamydia. I don't need any more. Chlamydia is one of those things where one is probably enough. Oh, this is why I hate this place. This is why I hate this place. It's a wood ladder back out to the top. I don't need to... Shit! I was going to say I don't need to run my um my, my helmet like because I have the NVGs. That was a double tap. Fuck, I love armor piercing around so bleeding much. Turn you off. And I want to turn on. I'm not wearing a moment, actually. Turn on you. I've got Kane's red NVGs, not the gross bloody green shit that's in vanilla. All right. I wish I had the suppressor. I really do. I could go full Sam Fisher stealth, but... <sighs> shit, apparently not. There's a bl oh, I can't shoot through that. I mean, I could, but the game won't let me. Can I reach with the shovel? Oh, yes, I can. Go with the normal rifle. Go... Boop you. If I can close that door, get the AP ammo back out and put on you again. Oh, no. Oh, take cover. Around the corner. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. And there's still some down there, too. I burned the bleeding church down. Shit. Maybe AP ammo isn't all that. That hurts so bad. I've kind of just got to let that burn itself out down there. I don't think it can spread up to the main church up the top, but I like most of the ground underneath is just like the scaffoldings and stuff. I don't think it can spread all the way through. If it can, then well, I can't really get through the fire anyway. That whole the tunnel was just a wall of flame. So while I'm waiting for that to calm down. I'll get some springs out of these cars. G'day, Chuck. 
How you doing? Probably considerably better than I am right now. I reckon it's probably been long enough, and if it's not, I've got no more cars to break down anyway, so... <laughs> I, I'm incapable of sitting still, so I'm gonna go and... See... What all the ruckus is about. Are you... Out here? Where are you? You sound like you're really bloody close, but... You back this way? Are you just are you just underneath me and stuck? That's probably more likely. You do sound heck and bloody close though. Look at what I've done down here. So it's burned itself out. Where is this guy? Are you? Are you oh, did you flank me? Did you go outside? You, you tunneled your way through and ah came out the other end. Holy shit! Holy shit! I put around in this chest and I really shouldn't have. There could have been another explosion. Oh, wow. All right. I knew <laughs> I knew today it was dicey. This is going to a whole new level. Yes, yeah, it looks. So thankfully, because it was mostly contained, even though that's gone straight up to heavens, uh, it's not really burned down most of the building. It's still mostly okay. But running around that corner, just getting out of the line of sight of the explosion is critical. I, I kind of realized that the other week and I've been using it occasionally, but something like that, I was well within... I remember you well within the blast radius of that, and I did not want any bar of it at all. I'm going to quickly go like that. I'm going to make myself a couple of building blocks, because I do need to escape this place when I inevitably tickle another pickle. You go through them. This is... I just want to live. I just want to live another day. I've woken them up. Oh! Oh, I didn't close the door in time. I didn't close the door in time. Get back. Get back to the ladder because this was actually a pretty good plan before. Wait with the AP rounds. Didn't kill one behind. I can't even see him. Oh, that was a risky shot when I couldn't see where to aim and what not to aim at. Old mate Bulkasaurus was just in front of you blocking all the bloody of you. He just that swole. Uh, I'm actually going to take you guys because I need the polymers. Grab that. Grab that. Nothing else in here gives me springs. All right. Is that everyone that was down here? So that's the thing. You walk out on that ledge, you fall into this cupboard with a couple of demos, it's all over. This is another one of those areas. It's another death trap because all the way along here are these little coffins that have demos hiding out in them. Can I go like you? I don't... Like They usually trigger when you cross the zombie line at the very end of the hallway, so I might be able to... I wasn't able to. Oh, I definitely wasn't able to. Put one into you. Close the door behind me. Quickly get back up again. Up, up, up we go. There's no bloody door on that bit. Wait for it. Dropped him. Shit, shit, fuck balls. Oh my God, why am I so shit at this game? Why am I so shit at this game? I've played at least five seconds of it in the past. It's probably an understatement. And I still can't fucking figure me shit out. Where are yous? Come on, waiting for it, doing the waggle. Sat. I didn't quite kill that guy. I am rolling with the right goal because I'm pretty sure I am. Okay, all right, <laughs> all right. There's a lot of very fast, very tactical uh, retreating going on. Mostly because I'm just shit. There's not even any like good loot or anything in the back of these little zombie cupboards. It's just, <laughs> it's just nah. It's just a big old middle finger to all my hopes and dreams. I'll take you. That's a big hefty door just there. It might prevent an explosion or none. Turn off the headlight, open the door. No, no spawn behind me, we're okay. Have a bit of a squiz. Yeah, see, there's one. There's gonna be a few of them lurking behind these shades. This is where all the beds are too, actually. I've got AP rounds. I just can't quite see where your head is. You're up a bit higher than I thought you might be. Probably about... Probably about there. Probably about there. Old mate Preacher came down from his pulpit. Oh, get a couple rounds into you. Get them all on a straight line again. Or as close as we can. That's some bloody good shooting by me, actually. Oh, there's so many. There's so many, but I'm so good! Oh my goodness! I'm either fucking incredible or I'm dog water. There is no in between for me. And then look at this. Look at all the beds. Never been so excited to see some bunk beds since I was six bloody years old. 
gorgeous. Absolutely top tier. Stoked with that. Uh, I don't want to pop open that door yet, though, because that's a direct line to the surface where there will be more demos. Fuck yeah, Jigglypuff. What a gorgeous day to be a me. I've broken down all the beds, I think. I've got... 33 springs on me and actually after having broken down the cars at the front i'll break down you as well actually i should have enough springs now to make what's more important though i mean i, I can't make the tier 5 rifles and guess i'm one one solitary book away from making that i think i'll wait i know it seems silly like a tier 4 is obviously better than a tier 3 but uh, I think it's probably worthwhile me just holding off a little bit and just trying out this newfound patience I apparently have and waiting till later. Five more lockpicks, thank you. Scrap you straight away and I'll take the rest of this stuff too. Can I? I can now one hit regular boxes with my steel axe. Bloody love that. I can also make... Ooh, thank you. I can also make better steel quality... <gasps> Oh, I was two books away. God damn it. I got nipply. I got nipply, but I got nipply too early. Story of my life. Oh, but there it is. Ah, oh, but there it is. All right. We're only, only a fraction too early. We're fine. That's, that's enough that an apology can probably make up the difference. 100 out of 100. Sniper rifle. Quality 5. Bloody bonza cobber. I'll take you. I'll leave that stuff in there. Break it down for the steel and get back to trading. I'd love a better harvesting tool like an impact driver or something. That would be sick. Scrap you, scrap you, scrap you. Take the rest. Gun store box I haven't touched yet with some explosive magazines. Yeah, now we're all right. We're all right. We're doing okay. It's a little drizzly out here. And when it's raining, <laughs> given the recent set of events, it's probably raining demo men as well. And it's definitely not a hallelujah. It's looking pretty okay. We'll quickly just uh, slink back out the front, jump back at our sweet ass hog. And oi, get away from my bicycle. My bicycle? My uh, mini bike, please. That's the one. That's the shots. I'm so razzled. I'm so razzled and rattled about what happened in the basement down there. I can't even think anymore. Not that I was great at that to start with. So I don't think Trader restocks until day 31. It was 28, but yeah, so day 31's the next time he's gonna get some more gubbins for me. Hopefully some springs, but I can't really rely on that. But I've actually got a little bit of time up my sleeve. I definitely made it home earlier than I was expecting to. So I might for once in my life try and use my time well and go and see if I can do some more harvesting and get myself some more springs. Because at least then, in fact, just given that, I'm still cucumber for no reason. Put you into them. Thank you. Hand in the job. And also check your vendo for any extra candies I might need. If I can get some more springs, I can make a better rifle, better tools, better everything. Everything is relying on springs, which means hackers candy. Probably a pretty good idea. Trader Hugh, here's your job. Your job is done. Hmm, you're not as good as what I'm currently wearing. The SWAT helmets are like the toppest tier of armor, which is why getting them so often out of bags is a weird feeling. You've got a stun button, gross, you've got a triple storage pocket mod. That's really the only option worth talking about. So, yes, please. Any other jobs? You've got to clear zombies, restore power. That's probably not a terrible idea. Downtown Marketplace. What's the other one? Hotel Zambona. Hotels were an awful idea. Hotels, if I was trying to get through the church, I'm never going to make it out of the hotel. Absolutely not. I'll take the marketplace instead. And that might be a tomorrow, Josh, thing. <gasps> Skill point to spend because you can have that one. Salvage operations. In you go. More springs for me. There's really like nothing left. There's, oh. There's nothing left holding this place up except for demos, apparently. Uh, I need you guys to not be here because I quite badly... My scope went weird for a second. I quite badly need this place to be working when the... Oh, oh my God, he came up behind me. I almost said the guy's nip as well when the next horde rolls around. That was a good shot on you. On the trots. You as well. And the last one. Is that everyone who was in them? I can't, I can't have demos like uh, scoping this joint out and lacing it out for when I have to come back and use it as a base inevitably. Yeah, nah, we're fine. We're fine. We're fine. They just keep respawning here. I'd once again like everybody to appreciate them doing the sensible thing, not the fun thing. I'm going to use those springs to make that cement mixer. That's definitely the more pressing one because I can hardly be out of time. It takes to make concrete. Concrete makes horde bases. Horde bases keeps me alive, or at least it tries to. So that's clearly the better idea. But 
Did I bring back? I did not. Oh, I did actually. I just need a shitload of duct tape. All right, hang on a second then. Duct tape, I can make not a lot. I need you then. I've got no fuel on me at all. I did bring the wood home though, so I'll grab that one. I need you with all your stacks of gunpowder, which looks bloody beautiful, to make me as much glue as you can. It's cheaper in you. 640, 640. Bang on the nip, but I'll make it even faster. Nice. That's still not enough though. That's still not enough, so I need... Actually, no, that, that's it, isn't it? That's that's where it gets made. That's with regular water. All right, so while you're doing that, I'll get you making more water. My whole life now. My whole life is just making sticky goo. <laughs> Shit. Just trying to sort all this stuff out. And my, my water to glue to duct tape production has actually taken up a lot of my time. It's about to be night time now. Uh, you, duct tape's another 90. You, while I'm waiting for this though, I've got my supercharger on the craft and another bellows. I had a spare anvil, so once I have that, I should have all of the different things I need for my uh, production. You can go like that. I'll chuck you into them. You've got no wood on you at the moment, so I'll grab... I need the coal for gunpowder production though. Uh, someone was asking, by the way, while I'm so focused on making ammo, I have shit loads of regular 7.62. It's purely to make that AP 7.62. You've seen how good it is. That's why I want it so bad. It's absolutely saving my life, especially on horde nights when we're all lined up like that. Get you crafting like that. It's not, it's not much. It's not much. It's bloody really not much at all, is it? This is why, like, for so long, I've just been in the mindset that going and looting cement is always the better idea. It's just not nearly as lucrative to invest in a new forge to do it that way. I get stones cheap, but still, that's not nearly as good. I'm starting to run low on bones as well, actually. I should probably be keeping my eye out for anything that, oh, actually, that any, anything that I can take that's gonna have the, uh, like, have bones in it is probably a pretty good idea for me to start thinking about putting down. What was I missing for the sniper rifles again? I'd love two T5ers. Just the duct tape. Just the duct tape. I'm making it as fast as I bloody can. <laughs> this is taking forever. But let's go see if there's some deers outside. Deers are made of bones and meat, and I need both of those things. It's going to be a while till I have the duct tape. I need to make myself the sniper rifles. I'm very tempted to start ammo production, but to make those boxes at AP, which I should have the ability to do now. I do. I can make eight of them. It's going to take 43 minutes. But it's going to get in the way of my sniper rifle craft. I think I can get the glue that I need tonight. And then crack on with a tier 5. At least one tier 5 in the morning. Because what? I've got to go into the middle of town to there. Actually, I need to find a car lot. If I can find a car lot, I can chuck in that hacker's candy. And break down everything that I need to get all the springs that I need. I'm not... Oh, is a car park there? That's actually a drive-in movie theater. That's a bad place to be. Where, where are people buying cars in this bloody city? There's nothing here. Anyway, I'm going to sit here and nurse my crafting that I need to to make sure everything's cooking along nicely. Like you. You're still working away. In fact, you can stop. I'll take you and I'll get you whipping up some more concrete for me. So now I'm out of stones. All right, so I need to go get all the loot from the horde base. I need to go mine some stones, do the crafting, and try and get that tier 5 sniper for tomorrow. Because I reckon, I'm going to chuck you in straight away. There's enough cars, like, down in here. That if I chuck in my hacker's candy, I can grab all of those. And maybe a couple of extras on the way through. And then I'm right next to the, the tier 4 clear. Anyway, that might be the best idea. But I'm going to have to come back and find out it's probably a terrible idea in the next episode. Because this episode is done. So thank you guys for watching. Most of all, thank you to the patrons of Patreon who made this episode possible. If you liked, make sure you hit the like button down below. And subscribe to this channel. Follow me on Twitter. If I don't talk to you there first, I'll see you in the next episode. Have a good one.